So in this question, I'm looking at the planes and I'm trying to find the angle the plane makes with the horizontal plane and the vertical plane. Now, if I look at my SOLIDWORKS model, as you can see here, we have the vertical plane, we have the horizontal line and we have our plane. What I am looking for is if I look at this plane and if I can get my horizontal plane and my, my plane there as an edge view, this plane is now making an angle with my horizontal plane. Now, as we know, the horizontal plane becomes the XY line in an elevation. So I need to get an auxiliary elevation showing the edge view of my plane. This is, first of all, to get the angle that the plane makes with the horizontal. So we're going to start with that one. So I have my plane here. So in my elevation, I'm going to take a horizontal line. Now, because I've taken a horizontal line, when I bring it down to my plan, it's going to give me a true length. The horizontal line I've taken hits my line BC here, so I'm going to bring that down to my plan. And when I bring it down, it's giving me a point here. So that's going to join back to A. Now, I know that now is a true length. Now, you might think that looks like a horizontal line, and it is, but that is a coincidence. It will not always be the horizontal line. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring that point over and I'm going to bring all my points over parallel to my true length my x1 y1 line is going to be parallel to or sorry perpendicular to my true length line so that's an x1 y1 now because this is a plan this is an auxiliary elevation now, this is very important. My horizontal plane is seen as a straight line, i.e. the xy line in an auxiliary elevation. So this is my horizontal plane. Okay, the x1, y1 line equals the horizontal plane. Okay, now I'm going to get my heights from my elevation. There's B, A, and C. I'm going to join them in here. Okay, and this is an edge view. As we know, edge view. The angle that the plane ABC makes with the horizontal plane, I'm going to extend this on here now, and my angle will be this angle here. I'm getting an angle of 42 degrees. Please do not make the assumption that this is always a horizontal or vertical line here. This, These three lines are parallel to my true length line, and my x1, y1 line is perpendicular to it. So as we can see, if I have a sketch here, and this is my vertical plane, this is my horizontal plane, this is the XY line, as we know. If I stand in here and look in this way, my horizontal plane becomes the XY line. Therefore, I know that the X1, Y1 line is the horizontal plane. Likewise, the XY line in the elevation is the horizontal plane. Now, the next part of my question is they're asking me to get the angle that the plane makes with the vertical uh, plane. Now, if I stand up here, and I look down the way, my vertical plane becomes my XY line in my elevation. So what I need to do is I need to draw a horizontal line in my plan this time. Now I've already used A, so I'm just going to go from a different point. This also shows you that it doesn't have to be a point to use it. So I'm going to draw a horizontal line here. And my horizontal line cuts AB and it cuts BC. So I'm going to bring up those two points. So A, B, and B, C. Now, because this was a horizontal line, I know this line here is a true length. That's very important. So I'm going to come over here at my angle. And I'm going to extend my lines on. 
this is not a horizontal line hopefully you can see it's not a horizontal line and it doesn't have to be if it is a horizontal line that's okay but it's not a horizontal line I'm going to draw now my x1 y1 so there I have my x1 y1 this is an elevation so this has to be an auxiliary plan we always know as well that because I'm looking down here okay this has to be my vertical plane this line is my vertical plane now because this is a plan I'm going to take my distances from my x y line down to my plan sorry wrong distance there B R A. And as we know, this is an edge view. Now, I'm being asked for the edge view to the vertical plane. And this is the vertical plane. So I'm just going to extend it on. Just a little bit darker. Just extend it on. And when I measure my angle... I'm getting an angle of 48 degrees. So, if I'm being asked for the angle the plane makes with the horizontal plane, I need to get an auxiliary elevation. If I'm being asked for the vertical plane, I need to be getting an auxiliary plan. That is what is to be taken away from this. So, Horizontal plane equals an auxiliary elevation and vertical plane equals auxiliary plan. So we're looking for edge views. I'm just going to say ED edge view after that because it's an edge view of the plane we need to get in that. So just to recap, if I stand here and look in, my horizontal plane becomes the XY line in my elevation, because this is the elevation view. If I stand up here, my plan view, and look down, my vertical plane becomes the XY line in the plan. And that's how we're going to get the angles that they make.